Ah, uh, ladies and gentlemen, somebody sent me this picture. This is very relevant, especially during the holiday. Uh, there's somebody sleeping on an air mattress in a damn airport. Um, you ain't got to tell me either. You homeless or your ass is on standby. That's one thing I, I can't fly stand by. I, I, I can't do it. That's not me being bougie. That's just me flat out saying I cannot do that. I ain't no way in the hell. You fly stand by, my heart can't take stand by. My blood pressure can't take that. I don't know. I got to run to this gate, that gate. You be in the airport. You Your ass, the, the gate done changed four, five times in a day. You got to drag all this luggage over here. Wait two, three hours to see where you at in the line. Damn that. I'm buying a ticket. I ain't got time. You done put an air mattress in the air. No. Hell no. I'm better off driving. I'm not. I, I, I can't do this. I'm not. I'm buying. I know. By the time you get back to where you need to be, by the time you get back home, your ass. Ain't even, that ain't your house no more. They don't. You don't got evicted because you've been in the airport for six months trying to catch a free flight back home. I'm not. No hell no. My man got an air mattress. No. Like like one of them badass kids ain't gonna stick a pin in that thing, and you gonna be stuck in it when it's time when they call in your gate when they be like they call your name to come to the desk to see if you there for the free flight. You how you you can't get up. You gonna miss the flight again. Cause you in the air because you in the air mattress. The badass kids done poked the air mattress and all the air done went down. Except for on the sides. It's, it's flat in the middle. Nah, we hell no. Um 